Hey guys, it's Duke on and I'm showing you the easiest way to get bounty in Need for Speed Most Wanted. Now, once you click on Blacklist 15 and then go over to the bounty and click on that. Alright, now I want you to click on Rosewood Fire Station and then jump to the location. Now, once you're here, I want you to hit left on the D pad, not start like I did, and click on that Pursuit Breaker. However, you know, I'll kind of show you, give you a little more time to see in the video. This is one right here. We need to actually go as below it, but I'll be showing you in the video. Just follow the arrow most of the way. As you see here, you take a left. It's pretty easy. Just follow this. Now, just uh, kind of telling you what's going on. I have five times the bounty, so this is going to be the hardest it will ever be for you. This is literally the end of the game for me. This is the last milestones I'll need. So it won't be this hard for you starting out, and trust me, about many times you get this. Just pass that place up, I'm rambling. Go through this uh, building right here, break through the glass, and you need to go up that ramp. I'm trying to go up, but I get in a predicament. Crap hits the fan, so I go up this ramp, and then you need to take a right over here and go break through the glass to the left. There's this little place you can drive up to once you get all the way to the end and park. However... Do get some my booties, so I have to drive off and do a little mad dash for my life. Pro tip, turn off all those save. That way if you get busted, just dashboard and try again. Uh, yeah, so I do this little quick time event thing, whatever that is, slows down time. And I get up here, and I get on the very edge and park, and they will have extreme trouble getting up there. Now, every once in a while they will get up there, but... If they do, just drive off and do what I'm about to do when I show it to you. But yeah, tips. Uh, this is great for milestones. Like, if you need one for 10 minutes, this is ideal. Same for if you need to get 20,000 bounties. Well, not 20, but whatever. Anyway, if dude gets behind you like that, you need to drive forward and take a left up here. I usually go through the pursuit breaker, but crap, it's the fan. I thought I'm about to wreck. I just go this way. What you want to do is go this forward and then take a right and all you're doing is circling around and getting some tuck hops off your tail trying to. There'll pretty much always be a roadblock there. Just drive past it. It's nothing real big. And just, yeah, do this again. Get up there. Get on the little thing and wait some more. Yeah, it's easy. Trust me, this is the easiest way for you to get bounty. And it's a great system. It's not perfect, but it is a great system. Trust me, getting bounty in this game is just annoying. And uh, as you see here, I fast forward to where my milestone actually completed. Now, to get the cups off of you, I'm having a little trouble backing up here. Uh, performance issues, this never happens. Uh, just back up right here to get the cops off of you. And go right here and get all up against that glass and get in the middle and then just park now if anybody comes up the ramp either way go the opposite direction of them and they'll pretty much always wreck because they try to take their turn towards you too wide and they'll flip off the edge so this is a great place my brother found this place i am so thankful he did but yeah really easy way man this is the way to get bounty in this game awesome cheating but it's fun so yeah duke on two signing off i hope you guys have a great day and if you have any questions put them in the comments and feel free to subscribe all that good old mess peace out